Oh, this beautiful weather outside. Nice fall weather. Today, I'm bringing you the Land Race KH3076 4L. This is a four bedroom, three bath, two living rooms and retreat. We're gonna go ahead and start with the outside of the home. Come standard with the uh, 50 year LP smart panel siding. We have three exterior colors that you can go with. Uh, you have your body, as you can see here, uh, which is the white, the accent, which is our gray, and the black, which is our trim. We have 27 different colors you can select from. Uh, it doesn't have to be color coordinated like this one is, but you do have many choices to select from. Uh, one of the options that we have on this home here, front and back, is the eave lighting uh, over the majority of the windows this is a phenomenal look um, during the uh, early morning or uh, uh, late evening just lights up uh, the whole entire area around the home gives it a beautiful look also added security um, most police officers will tell you the more your property is lighted up the less chance somebody uh, would want to break into your home so we're just going to walk around really quickly take a look at the exterior I apologize that my gimbal for whatever reason is malfunctioning so my walking may be a little shaky so I apologize about that okay so this is a 30 by 76 four bedroom three bath two living room retreat room super beautiful it's one of my favorite homes and it's an exclusive here at the Fort Worth factory. See the Eve lighting. Alrighty, let's go ahead and go take a look. Now coming up this week, um, before we get started on this tour, just want to let you know that uh, this one here is the Horizon 56, the Horizon 76, and then on Monday we'll have the Horizon 48, along with the land race. Basically, right now inventory is hard to come, come by if you're looking for a home to be moved into immediately. Uh, so I have authority to sell uh, every home except for one. And the question is, which one? That's totally up to you. You can take the land race that literally just got put together. You can take the Horizon 76 or the Horizon 56 that has not been put together completely, or the Horizon uh, 48 that comes off on Monday. All of these homes can be yours. Only one of them gets to stay. Uh, reason being is that, of course, we're gonna be coming out with new models soon, and uh, we wanna put the prototypes together and have space for them. So one of the nice things as you walk into the land race is this four-year area. You have an area where you can put a bowl, keep your keys, uh, charging station, family picture, little knickknacks there with the uh, industrial pipe shelving. This home features eight and a half flat ceilings uh, throughout the entire home. Tape and texture with the exception of the pantry, utility room, closets, and bathrooms. The Land Race features a universal kitchen. One of the top features about a universal kitchen is that you have total control of your house, especially during the holiday season as people come over. And uh, the majority of the time, the host is in the kitchen cooking, getting refreshments, uh, just being a gracious host. So you can see here, we're walking in from the living room. You have your dining room over to the left and your family room over even further. So let's back up some. And as you can see from the kitchen, you have total control of the whole entire house. The land race features a nine foot island with two pot drawers, three base uh, cabinet doors. And then on the edge, we added a beverage center. Good place to keep wine or um, sodas, 
high C, fruit punches, things of that nature. Nice big farm picture window. We put the stainless steel appliance package on this home. So you can see the ceiling comes with wood beams. Our cage lighting. You have a nice sliding barn door here leading into your pantry area. Let's take a look. Three levels, nice big walk-in. You can keep plenty of Oreos in here. All right, let's go into the utility room here. So you have your furnace here with the return. And then behind the door is your actual electrical panel. Nice base cabinets on top with a rod for hanging shirts to dry. Those delicate shirts. You have your location here that you can do a chest or stand up freezer. Our rear door is a uh, 36 by 82 steel frame fiberglass door with uh, protected glass. Um, literally we can pound on this and uh, it won't break. You also have a storage closet in the utility room as well where you can keep all your extra linen, your supplies, gardening tools, your brooms if you want. Okay. All right, uh, I won't go into the master yet. Let's go look on this side. So on this side here, you have the dining room with an optional sliding glass door. What comes standard is just a standard uh, 38 by 80 door uh, that out swings. You have the optional buffet with wet bar. Awesome look to keep your uh, beautiful china in. And you have your family room. And on this one, we optioned in the uh, opera lighting, which we have not unwrapped yet. Has the electrical fireplace with the TV ready mount on top. And what that means is basically uh, where the TV goes behind the drywall, there's OSB. So that way you don't have to try to find a stud in order to put your mount in. It's already connected through that OSB and can support up to 250 pounds. And in here as well, as you can see, we have the wood beams. Okay. Then you have bedroom two and three with the bathroom in between with a one piece fiberglass tub shower versus a four piece. You're going to see it has a hamper insert there with the two base cabinets and then a linen cabinet on top of it. So plenty of storage uh, to put toilet paper or other toiletries in there, including your towels. So you have bedroom number three here. Nice, big, spacious bedroom with the walk-in closet. Now the home does come with two inch blinds. I just have them up so you can see. Uh, typically I keep them up just because I want more natural light to come into the home, but all the window fixtures will have them. Giving you uh, extra energy efficiency, they are UV coated, so that way they don't buckle over time. Still giving you awesome protection. Also, uh, keeping the dye color in your carpeting uh, from fading out. Okay, here's bedroom two. Also with the walk-in closet. wood rods and shelves versus just the wire racks. I'm gonna go ahead and close that door. I'm not sure if you've been noticing that all the rooms here have the uh, three inch block molding. 
That's the baseboards, the crown, and the door jams, your windows. It's all that two inch, I'm sorry, three inch uh, block molding. Just giving you a clean, crisp look throughout the entire house. So let's go into bedroom floor where we're keeping the extra materials that come with the home. With a nice walk-in closet like the last one we looked. But what makes bedroom number four very unique is that it has its own bathroom. So this is perfect for people who are cohabitating. <laughs> I still have a problem saying that word. Basically co-living together. Cage lighting as well. Being that it's a smaller bathroom, it doesn't have the extra linen area. But don't want to make the person who's staying in this room too comfortable where they want to stay forever. In case you want to, I mean, you can. But look at this, just a great, gorgeous home. All right, let's go look at the master bedroom. So the master bedroom does include a retreat room. But what's that door before we go into the master? Let's take a look. Something not commonly found in manufactured homes is a coat closet. Now, we can't say that Texas doesn't get cold because we know what happened last February. And maybe uh, something that doesn't happen quite often, but it does happen. Uh, so you can put your coats in there. You can also put your vacuums, your brooms, and, and uh, other cleaning items in there as well, keeping it out of the eye of your guest. As we come into the retreat room, we have dual French doors. And then it leads right into the master bedroom. On the master bedroom, I added the four corner uh, cam lights just to give you additional lighting in the room. You have your walk-in closet also with a double shelving and rod just to double up the space for you. Area for your uniforms or dresses. And we're going to the master bathroom. Nice big six door linen, dual vanities, dual mirrors. A nice mirror on the other side where you can get ready and look at yourself, put your shoes on. Nice big soaker tub. Let's take a look at that. And just like any other soaker tub, you we have the ability to add jets on there in case you want to turn it into a whirlpool type and then the elongated commodes comes also with the central shower with the sunflower shed above it or shed sunflower head above it 